Maggie and I went to Target yesterday. This video is from yesterday. Um, and they have so much Valentine's stuff out. So I just thought I would share with you guys. I do not remember there being this many card choices when I was a kid. Pretty sure there wasn't. But they have a ton of stuff. Like zero Christmas stuff now. It's all gone. And it's all Valentine's Day stuff. Tons of candy, and oh my god, I found the Yoda ring popped. I was so excited over that because I wanted to get those for Danbury, and I did. And look at this. This is kind of weird, but it's chocolate dinners. Um, It was a steak dinner. Then you have avocado and a banana. It's popcorn. I don't know. It's the popcorn is actually marshmallows, but I thought it was quite interesting. So they have quite a bit of stuff. There's actually a lot of um the Mandalorian at Target. So if you're into that, you might want to check out their Valentine's Day stuff because... It's popping. Oh, now, she asked about the anxiety meds. Can you message oh her and tell gosh. her to take one of yours? So cute. Look at that. So cute. Target <laughs> has some really Oh, cute shoot. Okay, stuff. well then. I like it so much. Um, but the only problem I'm having lately is they never have things in the size I need. I'm like, what is going on? with this it's always newborn i can never find newborn but then i'm having a problem shopping for charlotte so it's like it's whatever size i need they don't have it but you see that little brown hat on the table i did purchase it it's newborn size it's so cute and i'll give you a sneak into the future i am making myself a newborn <laughs> it's so newborn. handsome Ooh, so excited i was I wondering who you were to share that look how cute see there's tons of mandalorian stuff in the baby section but Target it's has cute. such cute clothing right now, especially for the little when boys. When I see good kids like I'm that, it makes me want to have set kids. with suspenders. I think there's like three different sets that have um, suspenders on it. And then this is the Gerber stuff. It's really fun and festive. All those colors are really just like, ah, oh, so much. I often want to get these sets, but then I find myself never using them. So I don't know. I do use them though, eventually, like on customs or dolls for sale. I just wish I used them more, but right now it's cold, so I might as well not even get anything like that. I love that dinosaur set that I just passed in show you. This I actually did buy for Faith like last week. That dinosaur set's so cute. Look at these little legs. Oh my goodness. Does anybody know who it is? So cute, says Roar. Ah, it's the baby that arrived yesterday. I was up very late working on this baby and worked on it more this morning. I was so excited. Just was so much fun to do. I just did like a fresh up of the paint, added more details, you know, put more depth into the hair, even changed his hairstyle. It's so adorable. Oh my gosh. So yeah, look at him. Cute. I even tried to adjust the fingernails to how I paint them, but they're not the same because I had to, you know, go over the work. And But yeah, I had a lot of fun working on him. And I think he looks super newborn. I love his coloring. So he's now available on the website. And those asking about the Kelly Maple doll, the doll sold. One of my friends bought it. It's actually going through a currently being repainted so you'll see it again later but the mommy is so excited and um yeah when that baby's ready to go home i'll show you guys but thank you for everybody that's asked about the doll it is now sold and oh i just love this baby i just i don't know I love doing the little newborn look. It's one of my favorite looks to do. Some people don't like it because they kind of think it's just, I don't know, newborns are not the cutest with their coloring at times. You know how it is when you have a new baby, but I love that look. I don't like the pretty look. I don't know. You guys know. I just love the very newborn look. I don't know. I'm crazy like that. Been like that since I was a kid. I've always just loved newborn babies, and once they start to get moving around, I'm like, ah, it's just too much, but... Anyways, so here's this one, and he'll never move on you guys unless you make a move, which I did a video on TikTok with him, and it's stop motion. It's so cute. He's moving around over there, so you guys should go check him out on my TikTok if you're not following me there. Here's Faith. She still needs to be changed, but I wanted to show you what um, she got when our gift from Taylor, the Reborn Baby, sold. We went and purchased her a couple outfits. So cute. Let me show you. We've got this terry cloth. It's like a mint green sleeper with butterflies. And it says lovely. Super adorable. That was from Carter's. 
Then we got her this outfit. So cute. It's a corduroy overall dress. And it was 40% off this price. Came with little tights that look like they have little red Mary Janes on there. It's a red corduroy. I don't know if I told you it was red. And then it's like got cheetah print on there. And then it has a gray um, shirt. It's not a onesie. Then she got some jeggings. Oh my gosh, so cute. To go with this mustard yellow color onesie that was on clearance. Another 40% off of that. It's mustard colored and the long sleeve and it has in white um, bouquets of flowers and then rabbits jumping along the way. So follow the white rabbit, right? A lot of us are doing that who are waking up, you know, us conspiracy theorists, which we're actually telling the facts. It's the CIA that made up that term in order to try to distract the public from the truth because they thought with the CIA saying it, we would believe everything and <laughs> we did. But until recently, we've been waking up by the masses. So, yeah. So, I have this for Follow the White Rabbit. I love that. For Q and stuff. I thought I would show you what the body looks like on this Yoda. Because nobody has seen it on my channel. And these are the Yodas that Tambri sometimes makes. So, she has, like, two dolls like this available on the website. And the other ones have, like, the bodies that Yoda comes with. So this one is magnetized. It will come with a pacifier. And she's going to come dressed in an outfit. The one that her photo shoot was done in. She can wear diapers. Tambri got these bodies off of Etsy. Um, somebody who makes Yoda bodies. We do need to cut those zip ties. I'm going to have to cut that. Because Tambri's going to end up mailing it. But the zip tie is not cut. But... <laughs> All right, so she she can wear diapers. Um, let's check her out. So that's her body. She's got like these joints right there. So her arms bend. And then you can put like shoes on them or socks. So yeah, it's quite interesting. It's a green body and it's just plush. There's no um, waiting in them. This lady on Etsy, that's how she makes them. They're just plush bodies. So Tambri wanted to give it a try and, um, you know, check them out. They're cute. Look at that. So there's the diaper on. And then let me get those as scissors and we're going to cut the zip ties. All right, let's cut this off here. I'm using a pair of pliers. It cuts really flush to the zip tie so then you won't get um, cut because they can be sharp. If you do not cut these as close to that little, you know, locking mechanism that they come through right there so just cut it right here and voila there it is okay now we're gonna put our clothes on her little sleeper it's a cute sleeper i love this sleeper it's purple with the swans on it it is so pretty this color of purple is really nice i'm not a big fan of purple but i do like this shade i seem to be attracted to it so I can't really say that I don't like purple. I like this color. And the swans look so nice. So she's easy to dress. Just like if you dressed a Cabbage Patch, really. That's what she's like. She's like a Cabbage Patch doll. So it's a different type of a cuddle baby. She's not waiting. She's got her magnet. Look at her, she has pink eyes. She's so cute. So yeah, so I just wanted to show you guys that body so you knew what you were getting because, you know, in photos, it's kind of hard to, I don't know, see what you're dressing and how is it gonna dress when you've never seen a body like that before. So hopefully that answers any questions anybody might have had about the Yoda and its body. So here's Charlotte. I know she's still in the same sweater romper that she was in the last time you saw her, but this outfit is so cute. However, I promise the next time you see her, she will be wearing something different. Oh, it's time to change her. I'm so sad. Oh, it's okay, but you can wear the outfit again. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. 
Um, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Also, I want to give you a reminder to not forget to tune in to the Right Side broadcast on YouTube to watch the President's Rally in Washington, D.C. It's going to be huge, and all of the voter fraud is going to be shared there, and much, much more. So those of you who are confused as to who your president is, which is still Donald J. Trump, um, you're going to learn why on January 6th he is still your president. You're going to see all of the criminals, things that have been taking place that you had no idea, um, that many of us have had no idea. It's going to be insane. So don't miss the January 6th rally. It's really important information, especially for you guys to know what's going on in the world, um, which is really hard to find the truth right now. But tune into the Right Right Side broadcast on YouTube. They always share the truth. They're a news channel that is on YouTube. um, Really good channel to follow. They love the president, and they are great patriots, so they share nothing but facts. All right, guys. Well, stay safe. Stay positive. Don't give in to negativity. That's not good. Remember, when you're feeling blue, just smile, because somebody in this world cares about you, and that's me. Yeah, I do. I care about every single one of you. All right, guys. Talk to you soon. Love you. Bye.